This is the world famous Son of Thurman, the Delaware branch of the Thurman Cafe business. The original, still open for business down in the German village in Columbus, not too far from Schmidt's Sausage House, but we've come up to the Delaware branch Son of Thurman just because it's bigger. The original Thurman's Cafe does most of its business in takeout here at Son of Thurman's, much better chance of actually being able to sit down and eat some food. The original Thurman's Cafe, still open for business and featured on Man vs Food on the Travel Channel, opened for business in 1942. Although technically the story of the Thurman Cafe started five years before that in 1937 when a 15 year old Macedonian boy named Costa arrived in the USA with his family to start a new life and five years later he opened his first business, Thurman's Cafe. Son of Thurman's, up here in Delaware, Ohio, was founded by Costa's grandson. They're still family-run businesses, they still have the same menus, including the world-famous Thurminator, featured on Man vs. Food. They developed the Thurminator for the bodybuilders taking part in the Arnold Classic bodybuilding competition, which happens in Columbus, Ohio, every year in March. And there's a Thurminator right there. It consists of a bun, lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise, American cheese, provolone cheese, ham, fried onions, mushrooms, a 12 ounce burger, bacon, cheddar cheese, hot peppers, and another 12 ounce burger. Uh, there's also a pickle. <laughs> and no, none of us were quite insane enough to try eating one of those bad boys. I went for the bacon cheeseburger instead. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> size of a small child's head. Welcome to Thurman's, 18 different burgers on the menu. Thurman's have 18 different burgers on their menu. This is just one of them. Every single one of their burgers is at least a three quarter pound beef patty. This has also got a quarter pound of bacon on it. And then there's the cheese as well. In this episode of Gnome vs Food, food's going to get its ass kicked. So, yeah. This issue of no versus food, food just got its ass kicked. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> it's a tradition in Thurman's that guests leave a signed dollar bill pasted to the wall when they leave. Now, I don't trust any of that funny American money, so I left them a good old honest British five pound note instead. I think that means I'm about $9 down on the deal. <laughs> ah, what the hell, it's only money. And the burger was totally worth it. That's all, folks.